No, I think that's <laughs> that's actually creepy to be honest. Hello and welcome back to Everyday Myself with Tari. I'm here to give you lifestyle advice and tips to help you live your dreams, achieve your goals and become the best version of yourself. Now, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe by clicking the red subscribe button on your right hand side so you'll be the first to be notified every time I post a new video. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing the never ever ever challenge. Okay, so I was tagged in by one of my friends at Daisy Osawe and she said I must do the challenge. So I'm going to be doing it today. So today is just going to be a chilled and very relaxing video because it's just a challenge getting to know me. Just another video about getting to know me. Okay. So the questions, I'll be reading the questions from a piece of paper I've written down. So if you see me looking down, that will be why. Okay. So the first question is, never have I lied to a friend to make them feel happy. Okay. Have you ever lied to a friend to make them feel happy? I think I might have. Okay. Maybe not lying per se, but just not seeing the, the, the thing the way it should be so that the person doesn't feel so bad about it okay and the second question is never have i ever talked bad about someone when drunk okay and like i said before in my previous get to know me videos i do like a glass of wine from time to time but i won't drink to the extent that i'll get drunk and start talking so that is a no for me never ever ever had a secret ig account so no I've never had a secret ID account. I only have one ID account, which I only started using recently. I'm not a, I'm not so, so big on social media. So managing one ID account is work enough for me. So I've only got that one. So no secret ID account. The third question, call the wrong person and pretend that you intended to call them. <laughs> well, I think we've all done it. Okay. Sometimes you pick up your phone wanting to call someone and then you realize that you've called the wrong person. Sometimes you're like, oh, sorry. I wasn't intending to call you but most of the time we just act like okay you know what just go with the flow you know so i've done it a number of times the fourth, fifth question have you ever never ever had a threesome so that's a no for me okay <laughs> i've seen movies i've seen things i've heard about it but i've never ever had it and i don't think i'll ever ever <laughs> have a, a threesome okay so the the sixth question says never have i ever said nude okay i'm gonna do what adesis uh, did as well you'll need to ask my husband that okay i'll leave it at that okay dated a sugar daddy have i ever dated a sugar daddy no i've never dated a sugar daddy but thinking about it now i think it would have been nice <laughs> you know <laughs> to have a sugar daddy to be sport and pampered by a sugar daddy but I never had a chance <laughs> but that's for that have you never have i ever had a one night stand so that's a no for me i've never had a one night stand because i think i've been a good girl all my life <laughs> sometimes i wish i was more adventurous but no i've been a good girl i'm always a good girl so i've never had a one night stand never have i done a be the s7 okay i've never heard that word before but apparently it means being chained and flogged while having sex or while doing the do okay i've never done it i think sex should be enjoyed it should be something of fun so i don't see any reason why i should be tied and flogged for the sake of it well i know some people that enjoy it rough but not me <laughs> i'm too gentle so no 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 okay so it says never ever ever thought of running away from home i mean i've never thought of running away from home because like i said i've been always been a good girl i've come from a very loving and happy family so there's never been a reason or any occasion where i thought of running from home so that's a no okay never ever ever attended or gone to a strip club so that's a no for me I remember going to Amsterdam once and then walking through um, the red light district and like, okay, this is the red light district and all that, but strip club, never, okay? And the next one is collected three times a day <laughs> when I saw this question by Laos. And I'm going to put this question back to you. What do you mean three times? Do you mean three times in the whole day or do you mean three times on a go? <laughs> So that's the question I'm going to put put out to you and if you do give me the answer then I'll give you my answer in return. Okay, it says gone on 
on a date without intending to pay okay so many times growing up i grew up in africa when you go for a date uh, with a guy you expect the guy to pay so that's just how it is okay so i've never gone on a date with a guy and expected i was going to pay for it okay okay so met someone on a dating app okay now i want to give you a story the story of my life so some years ago i was single and i was thinking of okay i was living abroad at the time and i think i just broke up with my relationship after a while i was thinking okay you know what i need to move on and then someone said oh why don't you register on a dating app and i did and that was like the biggest mistake of my life because all the people that came around were either this or that were not um my the kind of people i wanted and then this guy came he was so cute and all that and i really liked him on the dating app and then he says okay let's meet up he actually lived not far from me and i'm like okay let's meet up and once i said once he said that let's meet up i'm like okay it's actually too soon to meet up let's actually have a conversation first before we meet up and then he was like oh no 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 let's meet up let me i'm like okay and then what he did besides showing me different pictures of his different parts of his parts and i got really irritated i'm like you know what we should get to know each other first before you start showing me these things <laughs> you know i felt embarrassed i'm like no do i want to go on a date with this person <laughs> the day didn't go ahead okay so that's just my little experience of um, online dating okay so it says called my husband never ever ever called my husband by the name of an ex i've never done it um no i don't think i've done it no 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 okay never have i fought with a friend physical fights no <laughs> no i'm too soft i'm too quiet i'm too gentle no i've never fought i've never had a physical fight maybe talking because i have i talk <laughs> apparently talk for a living so yes maybe talk like okay why would you do this how would you do that and that but physical fight no okay never have i been expelled or suspended no 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 i've never been expelled or suspended from school work anywhere no never have i ever lost over another man while married okay so no i would not lost over another man and um, i know i there are people that are fine okay you see a guy you admire them so i admire people female male i admire them but i love my husband too much i would not um lost over anyone else <laughs> okay so never have i ever had a fake social media account to to spy on an ex no no i think that's <laughs> that's actually creepy to be honest why would i want to do that so that's a no for me okay no secret social media account the one i have is a lot of work for me already so <laughs> i don't see any reason why i should have another social media account okay so the next question is kissed someone of the same sex so no 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 that's a no for me okay stolen money from my hobby no <laughs> honestly no i haven't i can take from him i can have his atm card and use his atm card i can take money from his wallet and all that but with consent okay because his money like i said is our money <laughs> so i'll take money from him with consent but not to steal from him no um told my friend someone else's secrets hmm. i did it once <laughs> i did it once and i felt as soon as i i said it i felt so bad i felt so guilty i had to call the person back and say okay this thing i told you i'm sorry i shouldn't have told you please don't don't just ignore just don't worry <laughs> that's how bad it was for me i regretted it and i hope i never have to do a thing like that again okay so have you ever had sex in the car hmm that's a big one i've never had i've never had it in the car but that's really interesting <laughs> but no i've never had the uh, sex in the car the next question is have you ever never have i ever thought of leaving my marriage 
no i've never thought of leaving my marriage i love my husband and um, 100 percent i've never thought of leaving my marriage at all okay so this is the end of the get to know me never ever ever challenge i hope i've done justice to it okay and i'm gonna tag a few more people so the first person i'm tagging is my friend and sister <laughs> you know yourself elias matters okay i'm gonna be tagging jessica trinovec i'm gonna be tagging precious meal i'm gonna be tagging um if the best channel okay well thank you all so much i hope you've watched this you've enjoyed watching this video if you've enjoyed it please leave a comment in the comment section like and share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so and if there's anything you'd like to know about me that i haven't mentioned in this video or any of my videos please feel free to leave them in the comment section as well and i promise i'll do my best to answer them Okay, well, thank you so much for watching this video. And if you would like to support my channel, support what I do on my YouTube channel, then please join my membership because that's how you can support me. But thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.